Hey guys, Paul Salud, Paul Cut Sports. Uh, I want to talk about and offer you my uh, prediction for the upcoming fight this weekend between uh, Luis Neri. We're very familiar with this guy. And uh, Azat Hovanishan uh, of uh, Armenia. Uh, this fight has a uh, very uh, big significance in, of course, the Super Banner way because whoever wins this one might first face the winner of uh, Stephen Fulton and uh, Noya Inoue. Here's uh, my thoughts on this fight. Powercast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. I'm doing this in English. Uh, I was hoping a lot more of non-Filipino will be interested in this fight because we have, of course, uh, from Mexico and from Armenia. And uh, I'm a, a boxing podcast, a vlogger and commentator here in the Philippines. And this fight, this, this fight uh, I have some interest in it. Uh, and I know a lot of uh, hardcore boxing fans in the Philippines would like to know about uh, this fight. Uh, obviously, uh, our very own Filipino boxer, John Real Casimero, wanted to get a fight with Luis Neri. Now we know why he couldn't get a fight because he's fighting for the WBC title eliminator for the super band and weight belt of, uh, of WBC. So um, this fight is very interesting for hardcore fans it it's not that popular here in the philippines uh luis neri is, is known but we don't know much about hovhanishan and now we've seen his record it's a very decent record uh, of 21 wins uh let me just make sure i can see it uh, correctly 21 wins three defeats and uh, zero draw while luis neri has 33 wins one uh defeat and uh, zero draw uh, so as uh, as that is uh, 34 and 28 years old for the Luis Neri, and uh, the height is not much of a difference. Uh, but uh, I think the last seven fights, not only the last six fights, uh, uh, Hovhannisian uh, have won that. Uh, the thing is, my concern here is that the, the quality of op opponent of uh, Azat is not the same. Uh, or should I say, Luis Neri has better experience. Uh, both of them has power in their hands. I've seen that the fight of Hovhannisian, he, he was coached by Freddy Roach uh, against a Filipino. Um, and of course, Luis Neri, we know that he has power. But the thing is, his power is not the same when he was uh, in the lower division. So I'm not sure if he can uh, really uh, hurt Hovhannisian. But uh, at the same time, Hovhannisian hasn't really faced anyone at the, at the level of Luis Neri. So that's what makes this interesting. There, there's a lot of fights from uh, popular fighters, boxers in the U.S. or around the world uh, who's fighting someone. Uh, and we know, um, obviously, uh, there's just too much gap uh, in, in, the, in, the, in the odds. Uh, but this one, I, I really feel that it's close. And... Um, I just felt though I'm leaning towards Luis Neri here. I I, uh, I wanted Luis Neri to win, and I think Luis Neri could win, could still win this one. But I won't be surprised at all if uh, Azat could uh, put down or knock out uh, Luis Neri. As I, I think he has power, like what I said, and uh, Luis Neri being uh, KO by Brand Figueroa uh, basically tells you one thing that uh, Luis can be hurt. Um, I'm I'm saying still Neri by uh, a close margin, maybe maybe by decision, or maybe by knockout. But you know, it's a toss up, really. It's a good fight. You should you should not miss it. What do you think, guys? Who do you think will win this one?